Hey everybody, it's Erin, and today I'm going to show you how to make an easy at home floor game. Uh, I have in front of us what we use in the gym, which is just a roll of Velcro tape that we put down on the ground. This allows our gymnasts to be able to practice beam, but on the floor, so when they're learning new tricks or different skills, they can do them on the floor. We're going to basically take this concept right here, and we're going to use it in front of here with some masking tape, a cut piece of paper, and some scissors. And that's all you need to make a simple at home beam on your floor. So what you're going to do is you're going to take a piece of paper, or a little bit thicker than a piece of paper, um, and you're going to cut it four inches in width, and whatever the length is right there. The most important thing is that we just keep it at four inch, that four inch width right there, which is the width of the beam. So what you're going to do is you're going to take that four inch piece of paper, and again, just make sure it's four inches at the width, because that's the width of the beam. You're going to put that down, you're going to take some masking tape, and just make, take the masking tape and make it the same width as that piece of paper. And then you'll just go ahead and cut it. And then you're going to slide the piece of paper over so you've got enough of a width to make, uh, to make it down. And you're just going to put your masking tape right there. Again, the most important thing is keeping that four inches right there. Put down your piece of paper so that way it'll help you keep a straight line. And then just roll your masking tape out. I'm only going to make a small one, but ideally you'd either want to make those four, six, or eight feet. The ideal is eight feet. Obviously, if you don't have enough room, you can do four or six feet. But ideally, again, you'd want to roll out about eight, about eight feet worth of masking tape right here. Then you're going to slide the piece of paper over again. Take some more masking tape. And again, just remember that the most important thing is keeping it overlapping right there so you keep that four inches of width. And then roll the masking paper dash down. And... And then when you're done, you'll just go ahead, take that masking tape after you've made those four, six, or eight feet, mm -hmm. and put it right there. Give it a cut. And there you go. You've created a simple floor game at home.